Welcome to my channel. My name is TK Shomwani, and thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you to all the regulars as well. Thank you. How cute is your girl looking? How cute? Look at that skin. Hmm? That summer golden skin is just popping. A well moisturized hand, a glowing girl. <laughs> feeling better because it's a new day anyway um i hope you guys are good and great thank you so much for um being the people that you are guys i need to confess something with everything that i've been going through lately you guys are keeping me sane it's so strange how strangers creating content for myself and strangers can bring some sanity into a life that's feeling a little bit tricky so i just want to say thank you for everyone who uses their wi-fi their data their neighbor's wi-fi whoever to watch my stuff it's a big deal i don't take it for granted all 562 of you thank you god bless you anyway i thought i should make an intro to this video it is still vlogtober it's going well so far let's see how how far we can keep it up you know uploading something every day so so far it's been good but I'm getting nervous, but you know, I'm just gonna have to be creative about what I put up and everything to make sure we keep you guys engaged and entertained. So today I am off to some place with my sister. We just have a few things to sort out in the morning. I already went for my swimming classes in the morning and then came back home to get ready. And then this is where we are, so I'll show you what I'm wearing. And then later, there is this place called Harvest Place. It's a mall in Kempton Park. It's newish or new i don't know i just recently heard about it and i thought you know after our errand that my sister and i are running um i want to take her out for lunch i think tiamo my youngest niece is also joining us so that should be cool so let's uh see how much of that we can capture and then you guys can just enjoy the day with us see you just now so this is how i'm looking for the day um hopefully i'll take a picture or a video later with like a full one um but i think you guys have seen this dress before so it's nothing new but i just love how it fits on me it's just so stunning and then i just took one of my scarves and wrapped it around my head because i haven't shaved and i want a clean shave when i expose my entire head so i just thought okay let's just look cute like this no jewelry nothing just easy you know looking like an island girl <laughs> let me show you my face it's okay, also this popping. Is close up of the face I'm here for the glow. Mm. Blue eyeliner and blue mascara. Love it. Thank you. 
So we went to this harvest place, right? It's a cute little mall, um, not with a lot of stuff, but all the basic, you know, retailers and random other cool stuff there. And there are very few restaurants, but you know, I saw it up here zero, so we figured let's go there because it's, it's, I've seen it in other places. And what I have experienced about a lot of these franchises or, or whatever it is, ne? these brands of, of restaurants, Sometimes you expect um, the same experience that you've experienced in another place. And it's so interesting to see how you can experience something so differently. Cause that W0 is so basic guys. Like the atmosphere was basic, the people around us. <laughs> it's just so interesting. The experience was not great, but it was nothing for me to write home about. The food was average as well, or maybe it's what we chose to eat. So now I know, and it's not a place that I really would definitely you know go all out of my way to go to you know because it is a bit far from my place but it's still within a gruleni if i can put it that way so i thought oh, at least now we've got more options but yeah i don't think so there's also a nice place that i think maybe if i do want to try something else is a, a coffee place called coffee culture it looks like a nice pastry and coffee kind of setup so maybe that i could give it a try but otherwise the doppio zero was like meh Actually, the, the waiter did something funny. So my niece wanted a Frizo. So how he gave the Frizo so weird. So we're sitting by the couch like this, right? This guy from behind us basically put the Frizo on the table like that. I was so shocked. I didn't, I didn't complain about it. I was just shocked. Like, so this guy thinks what he did is okay. Like he couldn't come around and, and hand it over to her. He had to like literally like this you see my hand going like this then someone putting a freezer on the table anyway that's it um but yeah that's it for me today our it was a, a small a very short vlog and there wasn't much interaction so hope you still enjoyed it we're gonna see each other again thank you so much for watching and remember to subscribe if you have not done that yet a like and leave a comment for me and let me know what you are enjoying about this, these vlogs or this one specific i'd really appreciate it keep well see you tomorrow Sun and I